There we go. First fish of the day. A little white perch. On the beetle spin. Seven and a half inches. Here's another. A little better one. A little one. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Fishing Southern Maryland. I'm your host David. I'm on Nan's Cove. I'm staying within the actual, if you want to refer to it, the harbor itself because we got a little bit of a wind coming out of the south which is kicking up some white caps on the main river. So I'm just kind of staying in the actual enclosed area. Uh, it's low tide so the bite is not terribly good but I am catching some perch on a beetle spin. I've used it before. It seems to be the go-to bait right now. Probably going to spend about another half hour, 45 minutes out here. After that, I'm going to head back to the house. Four. A little bit bigger one, maybe. As you can see, as you can hear, the wind picked up. He's a little bigger. Oh my. A little better. Still only eight and a half inches. really wants to play. Last cast. It's nice when you catch one on what you're going to say from your last cast. Good morning. Been having any luck? No? I'm sorry? Dad caught a crab. There you go. Great way to spend Father's Day. Not bad. Good morning. Heard you catch crabs. Um, I caught some white perch on a small beetle spin. You know, the beetle spin's probably about a 1 8 ounce or 1 16th ounce bait. Um, and I was casting up by the rocks up in that tree to try to keep the actual wind off of me to so I, if I could stay in one place and everything. Okay, to sum it up, uh, 11 white perch on a beetle spin. That's a grub by Yum called Christmas Tree. 
Uh, it's on a 1 16th ounce jig on a just a little spinner. Uh, and that's what did it today. Uh, haven't caught any catfish here recently. So I don't know if the actual water salinity is changing or not. Uh, did see one person catch one from the dock as I was putting the kayak in. But just haven't caught any recently. But again, it could be the fact that when I'm here in the tides and everything. Uh, so, fun morning. Uh, today is Father's Day. So to all the fathers out there, happy Father's Day. My father passed away about six years ago. I miss him dearly. Uh, I'll be honest with you, if you are a young person and you are watching this, piece of advice, pictures, you can always remember what they look like, but get some video, get some sounds, because I'm getting to the point where I'm starting to forget what my father's voice sounds like. I wish I had some, uh, some recordings of him. Just a little piece of advice. No charge for that. Happy Father's Day to everybody out there, and until next time, tight lines.